Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the problem your Ethernet is connected but there is no internet access so I'm going to show you four solutions here hopefully this will work for you so first of all you need to go to the start menu here then go to settings option after that you need to go to the network and internet option here then you need to go to the Ethernet option here choose the Ethernet option after opening the Ethernet option, you need to choose the private option here and then turn off the set as metered connection here. Then close out of here. So if that doesn't work for you, here's the method too. So you need to go to the search bar here, search for control panel, go to the control panel app here, then go to the network and internet option here, then choose the network and sharing center. Then you need to go to the change adapter settings here. Then choose the Ethernet option here. Right click on it. Go to properties. Then choose the internet protocol version for TCP IP4 here. This is the option here. Choose it. Then click on properties. Then choose the use the following DNS server address here. Now type here 8888. Eight, eight and 8, 8, 4, and 4. Sorry, there's have to be 8 here. So 4, 8, and 8, 8, 4. Then click OK. Then close out of here. Then you just need to restart your PC. Restart your PC, and hopefully that will work for you. And here's the third method here. If that doesn't work for you, you need to go to the settings option here again. Then go to the update and security option. After up going to the update and security option, you need to go to the troubleshoot option here. And go to the troubleshoot option and go to the additional troubleshooters. Then you need to go to the internet connection here. Click on that. Then click on run the troubleshooter. Then it will detect the problems here. Then choose troubleshoot my connection to the internet. And it will detect your problem then this will show you some and then this will show you the solution for you so troubleshooting couldn't identify the problem because I do not have any problem here but in in your case this will show you the problem that you need to fix so if you can fix the problem just close out of here and you can restart your PC again and the last solution is go to the start menu here again go to the settings option then go to the network and internet option then go to the status option and go down and then you will see a network reset option choose that and you need to reset now option here if you click reset now here this will show you a warning to click yes or no just click yes and this will show you to uh, you're not you now need to sign out here so just close it then close and then you need to restart your pc and hopefully that will work for you so these are the four solution if this worked for you so if you found this video helpful please subscribe to this channel and thank you for watching